FirstStepReading.com. Hi, this is Heather from FirstStepReading.com. Today is June 12th, and we're going to do some learning together. Are you ready? Okay, let's get started. We're going to start with the months of the year. How many months are in one year? Twelve! Good job! Let's go over them together. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. Those are the twelve months in one year. What month is it today? Today is June. June. So if you have this paper, you can get it out now. And you're going to want to cir start circling. So today is June. Circle June. Now we're going to figure out what the date is. Okay, let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. What number comes after eleven? Twelve. Now we have a pattern and we have to decide is it going to be a black twelve or a red twelve? Black, 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 red. Black, 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 red. Black, black. Good job. So now on your paper, you're going to circle under the date is 12. June 12. Now we're going to go on the back side. We're going to figure out what day of the week it is. Okay, first let's write our number of the day. Our number of the day is 12. How do we write a 12? We write a 1 and a 2. That makes 12. I'm going to show you how to do tally marks with 12. We're running out of space on here. You erase it and do it together. There we go. We get a dark color. There we go. Ready? One, the number one, tally mark one. The number two, two tally marks. The number three, three tally marks. The number four, four tally marks. The number five, one, two, three, four, and cross. The number six, one, two, three, four, five, cross, and one more. The number seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The number eight, one, two, three, four, cross, five, six, seven, eight. The number nine, one, two, three, four, cross for five, six, seven, eight, nine. The number ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. One, one, two, three, four, five is across. Six, seven, eight, nine. Cross again for ten, eleven. Now we're on twelve. One, two, three, four, five. Cross. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Across. Eleven, twelve. Every five we cross for tally marks. And if you look at tally marks. You can look at some addition problems, right? 
Because you see, 5 is across, so 5 plus 2 is 7. 5 plus 1 is 6. Look at that. 5 plus 0 is 5. It shows you groups of 5. Okay, let's figure out our letter of the day. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U. Good job. U is our letter of the day. Let's draw a U. And you know what? Today, we're going to be learning the short vowel U sound in our stories. Sixteen. 
kind of frame. There's a lot of worksheets that your parents can print off on 10 frames. There's counting with 10 frames. There's five frames. If you want to start, you can cover these and only have five. So just practice counting the objects. Counting to five and counting to 10. This is called our 10 frame. If you can make one of these, it's really helpful. Joseph, can you please keep it down? So if you can make one of these with an ice tray or an egg carton, it's really helpful because it lets you put things in and count what's left and also count what's in. So you would do this with an, an ice tray and you just take a sheet of paper and cover the rest that don't equal 10 or if you're working on five, you can put a sheet of paper here and work on five and do your worksheets on 10 frames. So one worksheet we have is just counting. So one of them would say, how many dots are in the 10 frames? So you could put the same amount of paper clips or pom poms, whatever you're using and you just count one, two, three. Or it could say how many are left until we get to 10, so then I count the empty ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 10 frames are really good for counting and adding to 10 or adding to five. So keep practicing your 10 frames. There's blank ones on there too uh, that you can print out and you can stick paper clips on the paper. So. Work on your 10 frames, counting and adding to 5 and 10. Now, we've been talking about our life cycle of our butterfly. Remember, it starts as an egg. It hatches into a caterpillar. It builds a chrysalis or cocoon around itself. Then when it comes out, it's a butterfly. This transformation is called metamorphosis because the caterpillar becomes something completely different. It now flies, right? So it goes through metamorphosis. We don't grow and become something different. We just grow and look bigger and older. We don't grow wings. We don't grow something different when we get bigger. But butterflies transform. They go through metamorphosis. And our other word we learned was chrysalis. So you were supposed to this week, if you had time, color pictures and do cutouts about, remember, about uh, the life cycle of a butterfly. You can color them, you can make them, and then the last step was the learning page, what I learned about butterflies. I'll, sh I'll get back to show you. Here's Haley. So you draw a picture of what you learned and then you write it. So you can work on that. Okay, something you learned about the life cycle of a butterfly. Um. Joseph, I still hear you. Joseph, I still hear you, please. Okay, let's go over our sight words. A, an, 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 are, as, act, did, do, for, go, got, give, has, have, her, his, I, in, is, it, me, no, not, of, on, said, see, she, sorry, that, the, to, will, with, and you. These are our sight words. These are the words we need to remember. Have your parents make you flashcards and practice these words. You can also watch the sight word videos and you can also read the books because it's the same sight words. So let me get our sentence. Oh. And let's go over a new sentence. So today we're learning about the uh, 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 short vowel 
know you were family. Can you say that with me? Uh, 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 like um. And our sight word is a review word. It's the. So if you have this sentence, get it out now. So read it with me. Mm, uh, mug, the, buh, ug, bug, hug, ug, hugs, dug. Lots of ug words, right? Let's read it so we understand it. These are commas. They mean we take a short pause. Mug, the, bug, hug, dug. This is a period. That means it's the end of our sentence. I'm now going to circle in green our ug words. Mug, bug, hugs, and dug. And the last word is our sight word. It's the. This is a word that we don't sound out. We should just know, right? The. If you need more help and more practice, let me See where I put my book? Sorry, today is a little more unorganized. This book will help you practice. Uh, you might have the online version or you might have the actual book. Doesn't matter, it's the same thing. So we've done short vowel A, short vowel E, short vowel I, short vowel O, and now we're starting our short vowel U stories. So you can watch all the different Blending videos online, A, E, I, O, and U. You can watch three-letter blending. You can watch the sight words, and you can read these stories. We are on Mug the Bug. That is the story we're on. So you can read that story today, and tomorrow we'll be on the Fun Pup. Okay? We're just going in order. Okay, so practice reading. Your short vowel stories, practice watching your videos, and uh, practice your sight words. Now we're going to end with our letter sound song. A says ah, 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 ah. The B says ba, 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 ba. The C says k, 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 k. Like apple, bat, and cookie. The D says da, 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 da. The E says eh, 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 eh. The F says like dog, elephant, and fish. The G says ga, 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 ga. The H says ha, 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 ha. The I says eh, 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 eh. Like girl, horse, and iguana. The J says ja, 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 ja. The K says k, 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 k. The L says ooh, 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 ooh. like juice, pipe, and lion. The M says mm, 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 mm. The N says mm, 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 mm. The O says ah, oh, ah, oh, ah, oh, ah, oh, ah. Oh. Like monkey, knife, and octopus. The P says The Q says qua 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 qua. The R says like penguin, queen, and rose. The S says The T says The U says like snowman, turtle, and umbrella. The V says W says wah, 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 wah. The X says kss, kss, 
Taylor from FirstStepReading.com. Please subscribe to our channel on YouTube at First Step Reading. Like us on Facebook at First Step Reading. And follow us on Instagram at www.firststepreading.com. Thank you for watching our videos. If you have any questions or any suggestions, please reach out to us on Facebook, Instagram, or on our channel. Thank you and have a great day.